William Henry Harrison, ninth president, dead after a month. What if he actually survived? Harrison was the first Whig elected president. In fact, the Whigs swept the election the year he won. His death stunted all of this, and his VP John Tyler broke with party lines supporting Texas annexation and James K. Polk, shooting down the idea of a national bank against his own former party. Had Harrison not died, the strong Whig control in Washington would have delayed the Mexican-American War until at least the 1850s. A national bank could have been re-established, and James K. Polk might never have been president since the Whigs wouldn't have been divided by John Tyler, perhaps delaying the Civil War a decade or blending the two conflicts together. Fun fact, Tyler is the only president never honored in Washington due to his allegiance to the Confederacy at the time of his death. 